and gorgeous and uh, big attacker. And so over here too, you can see we have this previous what we follow over here. We have this follow over here, which is hard and as what previous weekly low. So you can see when price went all the way up. The institutions were still what targets and this low over here. So they took liquidity what before price started reversing to the upside. So if we move to the day, the month in time from also. And the month in time frame, you can see why here. This was the weekly previous low, weekly low that we just did. You can see on the month in time frame, it just got two candles. It's it, it just two candles. Wow, the price went to the outside, came down to the liquidity, started pushing to the outside. Over here to what you see you have this also equal highs. See you have this equal highs over here. So when you see equal high what happened, serve as a liquidity target for the institutions and see it took out this high forward price gain to trace continue again. Okay, so same thing applies to the smaller time. Alright, so on the one hour time frame also, you can see we have this consolidation over here. So, or oh, do you see that you have this equal highs over here? So it's this equal highs over here, which is indicating what stability above. So the institutions will always be targeting more highs and the volumes are getting it. So sometimes when you come to the chart to make your analysis, you can just use just when you are able to identify what liquidity is in the market using this uh, buy stop liquidity and sell stop liquidity area, areas to, to focus on you'll be able to know or identify the direction then you trade along or you trade towards what the liquidity direction so we have this place over here so you can see we have this how this is over here consolidation over here and see others that's of liquidity is lying above this consolidation you can see we have what the downside liquidity over here price to cut this liquidity to the downside before the upside we know we have liquidity above also so after price to cut all this low price uh, finally went up get it to take out this um, liquidities also so that we have um, this one also over right here so you can see over here what we have the four highs over here you see you can see price went up take out this previous day high so this was a previous day high over here so price to cut that previous day high so that you have this previous day low previous day high it's on the one minute time frame so 
previous day low, previous day high. What happened? Price took out this previous day low. That's it. Price took out this previous day low and went up to take out this previous day high again before it started moving in its corrective what waves. I hope you guys are getting the points. Yes. Alright, so we have over here too, we have the trend line liquidity. Show you guys. Alright, so it's the same thing as what sometimes some people use the trend line as what they are support and resistance or they are supply and demand zones. But we use it to identify where liquidity in the market lies. So over here you can see that we had this equal loss over here. You get it. We had this equal loss over here. And so what, um, if I'm trading and I identify this over here, I know that what this way there is liquidity below this previous equal loss. So this place is what equal loss. It doesn't necessarily mean that since we are seeing equal lows, then it should be on the same ground. You no, know, it can be on a sideways. I get it. So this is the sideways over here. So with the sideways liquidity, we use the trend line to spot out this um, sideways moves. I get it. So what happens is what you can see that what price eventually what came down to take out what this liquidity is over here get it before its price started retracing to the upside so you can see over here that price took out this liquidity then it started pushing took out this previous day low previous day low over here and came up to take out what this previous day high So we had this move also over here. Price took out, went up, took out this liquidity again, consolidated over here for some time. I get it. Then came down to take out this previous day low, went up. Now there is liquidity above this place. So if you are trading on that, you should just be targeting this previous. Um, high, I get an impulse. What price took out this previous day low, and we had this previous day high over here, which led to this broker structure. And since there is 